This is our initial project presentation. Our team consists of Shane Weinstock and myself, Chad. Our data set comes from uh, the Dedman Center for Lifetime Sports on the campus of Southern Methodist University. It is uh, ID card swipes through their turnstiles. And the data ran from uh, January 2019 up until when we started uh, building our models. And that was March 11th of 2020. We we're going to use this to uh, predict future usage of the facility and also just uh, to help out with uh, student staffing needs. Looking at the stationarity of the data, you can see that kind of through this initial thing here that our mean doesn't depend on time. Uh, the variance is kind of pretty much all over the place. And even looking at the ACF, when you split these two up, you can look at the first half and the second half and they kind of match, but there is a little bit of a difference. So uh, based on all three of these, we're saying that uh, we're dealing with the stationary data set. There is a little bit of seasonality and we'll do that in our kind of talk about that in our second model. Looking at the different models we have, the first one we came up with was a kind of, we pulled a difference of a one minus B and it uh, cleaned up this data. You can see that after that, it you can see original data here, but after that you can see that it pretty much went to straight white noise. Uh, and uh, we ran uh, the BIC and the AICs on that uh, difference, and we ended up with a 4.1. So we decided our first model should be close to uh, an ARIMA 4.1.1. And then our second one, uh, we had some crazy transformations in here, and we ended up with a B36, uh, which kind of coincides after we looked at where the data came from. It comes from a college campus, so you're dealing with nine months of activity in three months of summer. So uh, came up with a 36 week uh, transformation on that. Uh, our first model, you can look at the prediction on that, did okay, and an AIC of a 2000. Uh, the other one, our second model, is this crazy seasonality of ended up being a 15.5 with an AIC that's higher. So looking at those, we're gonna stick with uh, our first model, one, just for simplicity reasons, and then for second is because of the uh, AIC being so low. Moving forward, we're going to look at uh, trying to see what else in this seasonal pattern. We're going to implement weather data into it uh, for a multivariate, and then uh, hopefully use that to be able to better assess the seasonality of it, and then ultimately use it to predict uh, facility usage and help them with their student staffing needs. Thank you.